Let's go, Barry. Go, start it. We're on fire. We are on fire. Hey, you want some ice cream? I'm a lizard boy. I'm a lot lizard again. Welcome, hoarders. They're gonna be playing some more Tony, Mafia. That assassination attempt means that Morello has openly declared war on us. We have to deal with him. If Morello didn't have accomplices with the politicians and other important city organizations, our forces would be nearly equal. If we liquidate those people, our opponent will be a lot weaker. That's exactly what we gotta do. Eliminate I think this is the steamboat place. one I was talking right. about. And as we all know, an all-out war must be avoided. Get the generals. Then the soldiers will give up without a fight. So this is what we'll do. We'll finish them off one by one. What do you mean exactly? The first in line is the city councilor who's caused us so much trouble. Morello got him into politics and that makes him a big supporter. We'll take care of him after the boy. And I mean today. The councilor is celebrating his birthday and has decided to throw a huge shindig. He's having it on a steamboat with fireworks and the whole nine. And he'll be making a speech to the paparazzi. There'll be a lot of people there who won't do dick against us when they see what happens to him. It sounds pretty risky. But well worth the risk. Vincenzo knows the plan. Okay. As I said, it's on a steamboat. It won't be easy to get in without an invite, but I know you can do it, Tom. Above all, try not to raise suspicions before we reach our goal. Of course, you won't get a weapon past the security, but I've dealt with that already. As soon as you get on deck, go to one of the men's rooms. There'll be a small revolver hidden there. Afterwards, just wait outside a while. The counselor will probably be hiding in his cabin, but he'll be out for the start of the celebration in his speech. That's your big shot. During the speech, you're gonna pop him down. It's got to be in public, and this speech is the best opportunity. There'll be a big crowd there, so you can blend in with it once this thing is all done. And then what? I'd like to get back to shore in one piece. Afterwards, it'll be nuts. There'll be some security guards on a boat, and you should be able to get past them in the chaos. If not, get to the bow, and Paulie will pull up in a boat and bring you back safely. So what, Tommy? It won't be a picnic, but you should pull it off. Okay. I'll do it. The boat is anchored on the waterfront on Central Island. You better get going or you'll miss it. Keep an eye on the time. Buna for the tuna, Tom. Buna for the tuna. Okay. So this is the one. What is that car? Okay, we need... Where is he? Well, here we go again, Ralphie. Today I need something for one use, because we don't know how it's going to work out. <laughs> hey, Tommy. Th 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 that's no big problem. I have here this little number. They're, they're pretty, pretty, pretty popular these days. Also, the this is a getaway vehicle. Solid. Look how easy they are on that. This thing's like three and a half tons. Yeah, great, Ralphie. That should do the trick. Okay. Take this bad Larry out. Now we already got Oh no, no, we don't have a weapon. We don't get the weapon until we're on the boat. That kinda sucks though. Uh how far is this? Yeah, that's gonna be pretty far down. Um so yeah. Okay, this I guess is where we park. I don't think it really matters. Ooh, there she is. Hey, mister, you got an invite? If not, kindly take a walk. Uh, I must have left it someplace. Uh, yeah, so like I said, beat it. Um... Do we have to call someone? That 
That door's open. Oh, 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 oh. I remember... A sailor suit. <laughs> That's how we get on without an invite. We dress up like a sailor and we're like, Hey, I'm a sailor. Okay. Get out. Let's see if uh, he'll let us through now. Yeah, bitch boy. I thought he was going to give me a hug. <laughs> okay, pal. Enjoy yourself. Oh, I will. I've got some shooting to do. I mean, um, yeah, I'll enjoy myself. I, I definitely am not going to shoot someone on this boat. Find the weapon that Vincenzo hid. Um, I remember something, and I know that this guy's named Skipper. Some of these dames ain't getting it. Maybe they want to try a real man. It's so nice tonight. I don't even feel like one. You know what? I know what's wrong. I hate this. You have to go to the door. I remember where fucking everything is. Okay. We need to get a key, but that skipper guy has the key. But for some reason, we have to stop at the door to trigger so that he will say, like, so he will actually talk to us normally. You know where the key's out of that broken John? Don't bug me. I have a lot of work to do. You're the right guy. I left something there. Yeah, right. Maybe I'll lend them to you. But you got to promise to clean up that mess in there and bring them right back. I'll wait in the stern for you. Clean up? Um, sure. You bet. Okay, there you go. But bring them back. Yeah, I'll definitely do it. He he he. I ain't cleaning that fucking bathroom. Oh my. Okay, that brings back some memories from when I did this before, and not good memories either. I ain't cleaning that fucking toilet. You're out of your goddamn mind. I feel like it used to... I feel like it made you clean it before. Now I think we have to... Go to the back, oh boy, such a good like the other side, because that guy has to come out soon. Yeah, these doors. Don't we have to go here? No. I thought. I'd like another coffee. Hmm, me too. When the waiter comes, we'll ask him. Am I missing something? Okay. So, you see how easy that was? You ain't so bad. Yeah. You could open a cleaning firm. Yeah. Okay. We did it right that time because you have to find him immediately or he's going to push you and be like, hey. Okay. Now we can hide that weapon. And now we can walk back out and I think then just go upstairs and we'll be set. This guy keeps sitting down in random spots and just blocking me. Okay. Finally got the dumb thing to trigger. Hello there, John. I hope you're enjoying yourself. Good evening. Yes, it's lovely here. How are you? I hope you like it. Thanks. We're glad to hey, be here. I'm glad you could make it. It's wonderful. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I think it's time too. Okay, run. We've got to run. I don't think I got hit once. Where's the boat? There it is. There it is. Let's go. That was way better than the first time I ever did that mission. Way better. 
We got away without losing one health. New free ride options were unlocked. That's awesome. I've never done this good at any missions ever. I remember that one took me like 40, Arnie, 40 tries before. Now all the politicians in the city are scared. Nobody wants to end up like the counselor. Nice job, Tom. But it's not enough. Now we're after Morello's right-hand man, his brother, Sergio Morello Jr. He controls the unions in the city. His biggest assets are the dockers' unions, thanks to whom he practically controls every import into the city. We kill him, and a big part of Morello income is gone. I think I know how we'll do it, boss. Sergio is usually at the Italian Garden restaurant. There's a telephone in the restaurant, and across the street, a phone booth. You go to the booth and call inside the restaurant, saying you want to speak to Sergio. I'll be standing in front of the restaurant with a Thompson. And as soon as Sergio gets to the phone, I'll waste him. Then we just gotta get to the car and make a quick getaway. What do you say? Yeah, I suppose I can handle the calling part. Get to it, boys. Vincenzo will give you your weapons. Okay. Go see Vincenzo. I hate that uh, his hair looks like half green. Hey, I heard you have weapons for us, my guy. Vincenzo, I need a Tommy gum and something for Tom here. Okay. Here it is, boys. I'll keep my there was like four Tommy gun Tommy guns up there. Now there's like never anything. Gotta hide our weapon. That's one of the most important things about this game. I feel like Mr. Bean behind that fucking old lady. Hey Ralphie, we need a car. Hey, I have a new uh, t t t t Terra plan here. It's decent and a real big s s sturdy car. You'll like it, Polly. It has a n n n new type of lock, but, but, but if a person is clever, it ain't no p p p p problem to open it. Just like this. Nice and easy. It push in and click. Yeah, that's how all keys work. <laughs> push in on, and let's click. Okay, let's get this bad Larry up and going. Get in. Takes 45 and a half minutes to start it, though. Okay, we already got our weapons. Now all we have to do is drive... Oh, that's not that far. Okay, the place is right up here. Yeah. Okay. Here we are. Stop right here, Tom. Okay. So I'm calling. The guy walks over and he's going to shoot the guy when he's in the phone booth. Yeah? Mr. Morello, please. Hang on. Buddy, Marissa Morello ain't here today. Try oh, oh, shit. I forgot oh, about that. Isn't him. Polly, move it. Morello isn't there. The wrong fucking guy. Why wouldn't it be? Come on. Come on. I wish this car would start and actually drive. That would be awesome. 
unfortunately, that's not what we have here. Might have to pull the old uh, get out of the car and shoot them tactic. So we have to go back to the bar. I know a quick way. Fuck! Of course for speeding. You know, I'm going 10 over, they're gonna automatically just be like, got him! Yeah, I'm trying to return to Salieri's bar, but I don't know if that'll ever happen. Now, I do believe you can just go in there and have cops on you, and I don't think it makes a difference. Okay, looks like we're gonna have to have ourselves a little shootout here. Bud. If you know what's good for you, you'll leave. First thing I gotta lose these cops. Fuck. Ah. I Okay. There, we lost the cops. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Tommy. It happens to everybody sometimes. Vincenzo and me have thought up a new plan. Biff told us that Sergio has a mistress who he spends a lot of time with. He must be there today. Vincenzo has put together a little surprise for him. All we gotta do is put it on his car while he's inside enjoying himself. That's right. All you gotta do is put this bomb right under his car. And you can just enjoy the show. Sergio usually leaves at four, so hurry. This time it has got to work. His mistress lives in a house in Oakwood. We'll know he's there if his expensive uh, little Oakwood's sports car is parked really out far front. away. Stick the bomb under it. That sounds a lot better. I'll get going. Oakwood's like way across the fucking map. Okay, we do need to take the bomb. Okay, we need a car or two. I don't think we can take that one. Uh, let's take our orange machine. Because that's the only good fast vehicle we have other than the white one to the left of us with the red rims. The rest of them are like slow as shit. One thing, well not one thing, two things I learned in this game. Always have your weapon hidden and always have the speed limiter on. The cops are the most annoying thing that you can have after you. Like, it's extremely frustrating um, to have them after you. But we have to go way over there. So I guess I'll see you guys when we get to their house. Okay, the house should be right up is. here around the Let's corner. Look. Um, it looks like there's a bodyguard standing there. Um, if I remember correctly, we have to watch him for like a minute or so. I think he goes back inside or like walks down the street or something. Looks like he's on a smoke break. I don't know how long I should wait though. Or do I have to call someone? Um. Okay, he's he's going in. La la la! I'm gonna plant a bomb on your car. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I was on the wrong side. But still, as long as we got a bomb on his bad Larry, fucking done with him finally. Fucking get in and get out, I guess. I thought you just got in and left. Fuck! I 
For God, it's the fucking... It's the woman. It's not the guy. The... So we Christ. still have to... No, we have no, yet no! To kill hey, him. stop! Shit! Damn. I completely forgot Damn. that it was the That's woman he was with that night, not dame. him at all. Later. That girl it came out and sat down in the car. I don't know, maybe he lent it to her or something. It just happens sometimes. There's nothing you could do. Put it simply, we gotta get this guy. Sergio meets with his bookie downtown in the parking lot of the Rainbow Garden restaurant. Get Paulie down there to fill him full of holes. You'll just drive, Tom. Then get away fast before the alarm goes out. I'll shoot the Now fucker. I'll catch that bastard, I promise. He'll be gone, and they won't even know how I did it. Now get a move on so you can still catch Sergio there. Okay, well, I think I'm going to end the episode there. Um, just because we did quite a bit already in this episode. Um, next episode, we will um, continue this. And I believe we'll also be to the point where I'll start be doing start doing missions that I've never done before. Um, because I think it's like just this mission and one more. And then I'm to the point where I'll be fully blind going through these missions. Um, just like not knowing any of the stuff to do. Um, but that's going to be it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you in the next one. And if you did enjoy the video, check out one of my previous, next, and related videos. And don't forget to check out my social medias in the description down below. <laughs>